I'm going to show you how to make a silky smooth beat transition using Power Director. Let's transition into some smooth beats. I have a song in the timeline track. I'm going to stretch out the timeline so I get a better view of the waveform. So I'm going to place my cursor up here until I see this clock with the two arrows. Hold down my left mouse button and I'm going to drag it to the right. Then I'm going to let go of my cursor and now we can see the waveform. Now I'll split the music wherever the beat drops. So you can listen to the music and you can also just use your playhead and your waveform. If you left click on the playhead, you can drag it over until you see right where the beat drops at a waveform area. Once you get your playhead to where you want, you can either click on the split button or you could do control T on your keyboard. So since I know where the beats are, I'm just gonna go ahead and split the clip at all the necessary positions. Next, we'll place each clip that we're gonna use at a split. So I'm gonna go ahead and place my cursor over the clip that I wanna drag down to the timeline, hold down my left mouse button and drag it down to track one. Now you can move your playhead to the position that matches up with the split here. And then you can click on the split button and it'll split that clip. And then you can hit alt delete and it will delete all of that after it. So I'm going to keep placing all the clips at the splits. Now I'm going to bring this clip here down here to use as an outro. So I'm going to drag it down to the end and this clip has audio on it. So I'm just going to place my cursor over this audio line and hold down my left mouse. And I'll drag this down to mute this clip. Then I'm going to press the end key on my keyboard to bring the playhead to the end of this clip. And I'm going to click on an empty space. And then I'm going to go ahead and do control T and that will split the music track below it because I don't need all of this at the end. So I'm just going to left click on it and do alt delete and then we'll remove that. Next, we're going to add a zoom transition between all of the clips. So we're going to go up here to the transition room. We're going to go to seamless. And we're going to go to zoom one. I'm going to click on zoom one. I'm going to click on apply selected transition to all videos on selected track. And I'm going to use a cross transition. And now we can go ahead and play this back. See what it looks like. transition into some silky smooth beats baby if you want to make an eye zoom transition check out this tutorial don't forget to smash my face to subscribe hit me up with your comments and drop me a like down below